all love our canine companions and exploring the great outdoors with them. We take them for walks around town, to the park, out hiking. Some of them may even get to enjoy time out hunting or boating with their families. But today, we're going to focus on swimming. Many dogs hate it, many dogs love it. But what about bull terriers? Do bull terriers like swimming? Welcome back to the Fenrir Bull Terrier Show. My name's Franny and I'm a certified canine leader here at FenrirCanineLeaders.com. This channel is dedicated to helping you learn everything you could possibly want to know about bull terriers. Then how to become high level canine leaders that can raise perfect bull terriers. So if you're a lifelong bull terrier lover, thinking about getting one or just started your journey with your new bull terrier, then this channel is for you. So make sure you hit that subscribe button and turn on the notification bell so you never miss a future bull terrier video. So let's dive into today's video and we'll see if bull terriers like getting their paws wet. Swimming is something almost everyone is familiar with, whether they own a dog or not. Being in the water is great exercise and a fab way to cool off on their hot summer day. But people aren't the only ones who enjoy a dip in the pool. Many dog breeds have a love for water and there are a lot of them that were bred to have a predisposition for enjoying a good swim, such as the Newfoundland and the English Setter. But even those breeds who weren't bred to make waves love to swim, some more than others. Today we're looking at how the friendly bull terrier feels about swimming. So first we're going to take a look at their origin. Bull terriers were bred to be companion animals. They love their families, love to play and are all around a good natured dog. They're even said to have a great sense of humour. That certainly is the ideal companion, but that isn't how they started out. They were bred from the bull terrier dogs used for hunting vermin and for animal blood sports. Though they were crossbred with others to give them a better temperament and it really worked out. Bull terriers are extremely popular today, but what does any of that have to do with swimming? Bull terriers are energetic and fun-loving dogs that will need at least a solid two hours of exercise a day. They want to be active and with their family, so if you go out boating, fishing or to the beach a lot, there's a great chance your bully will want to join in on the fun. These dogs are known to like playing in the water, they'll splash and paddle around as long as they're able. Though, due to their heavy build, large heads and stocky legs, they aren't always the best swimmers. They tend to sink and have trouble keeping their heads above the water. So it's important to supervise this breed for any playtime in the water. They may sink or even drown if their owner isn't vigilant, but none of that deters them. Though you'll occasionally get a bull terrier who is more than happy keeping a watch fly from the shoreline, it all depends on the dog and their personality. But exposing your dog as early as possible is still important. It'll make playing in the water and swimming less stressful. Though with this breed, a life jacket isn't a bad idea at all. It will allow them to safely enjoy the water with their family as it will help to keep them afloat and from panicking due to going under. But even if you're not comfortable with letting your bully swim, due to them not being the best swimmers, they will still enjoy the water. They'll happily splash in the shallows and keep the kids busy while doing it. If you have a bully that happens to be nervous around the water, start slow. Take a toy and play along the shore or throw it into the shallow area and allow them to go and get it. They may get excited about their favourite toy and forget about being afraid of the water. But it's always important to go at your dog's pace when exposing them to new things or things they have a fear of. If you force them into it, they'll become more stressed and more anxious the next time they encounter it due to their bad experience. So slow and steady wins the race and positive reinforcement is the way to go. Lack of exposure and difficulty swimming are the two major reasons bull terriers may not enjoy the water. If they've never been around it, of course, it's scary. It's new and their leaders will need to teach them that new isn't scary. It can be fun and if confidence is instilled in the dog, they'll generally do fine. The younger this starts, the better because they'll have more time to make positive associations with swimming and being around the water in general. It will also make future swimming easier for this breed as they build the necessary muscles to keep themselves afloat. But as suggested before, a life vest might be a good idea to help avoid accidents. So with the Bull Terrier, they do love the water even if they aren't the greatest at swimming. But swimming does have some great benefits if you can get your bully in the water safely. It's great for their overall health as well as being a fab cardio workout. It'll get their blood pumping and can even help them keep their cholesterol in check. 
You'd think exercise like that would be hard on the joints, but with swimming that's not the case at all, which makes her ideal for older bull terriers or ones with joint problems. It strengthens the muscles and joints, but is lower impact due to the body's buoyancy in the water. I hope you enjoyed today's video. If so, make sure you hit that like button, get involved in the comment section down below, and don't forget, if you're new here, make sure you subscribe as we have three dedicated bull terrier videos coming here every week. So I can't wait to talk to you again on the next episode of the Fenrir Bull Terrier Show.